Hey, it's Neo for the PlayStation 4. Neato? <laughs> I'm your pal Sloby. With me is my pal Diabetes. What's up? And my other, our other friend, uh, Mighty Dicktron. The shadow friend, Dicktron. The, the shadow friend who everyone knows. The lore um, expert. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Local yokai expert. Absolutely. Yokai locally. Mm-hmm. So Neo is basically Team Ninja's take on a Souls-like game. Um, I did a little setup before. It has a couple cool options. Like, you can play it 720p at 60 frames a second, which is what we're doing and recording at. Uh, just like the Samurai did, yes. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Uh, other fun yeah. facts besides the initial loading... This was this was in like oh I think was it eleven years in development or longer that long, at least really? thirteen, Ooh. thirteen years, at least yeah all that time and they couldn't even have a tasteful like bloodborne like title come up as the loading screen told us it was loading <laughs> like come on um so yeah the trick to this game was uh, Koei apparently wanted to make kind of like a historical realistic thing having a little trouble, so they turned to Team Ninja, who turned it into this. So it's still this, very realistic, though, right? This disgusting... This all looks realistic to me. This is historical, yeah. No, yeah, absolutely. I learned all this in history class. Mm -hmm. Specifically, this game was... This, yeah. Yeah, specifically this game was based off of an unused Akira Kurosawa script. Or at least that was the what it was originally going to be based off of. I don't think that holds up anymore. Probably not. It's been 13 years. The stage directions of the script must have been really complicated. Oh yeah. Wow. Exit per stage right, pursued by Noni. Should I be following anything that's happening right now? If if you are supposed to be able to follow any of it, I'm not aware of how or why or what. I think I think this is just a sort of samurai montage thing. Typical. I also forgot to tell you this is Witcher 4, pretty much. Oh, nice. Hmm. Geralt of Kansai. Like Oh. Shang Tsung. <gasps> Hi, Oda Nobunaga. What are you doing here? I I was going to say that's totally Oda Nobunaga. Is that his name? Oda Nobunaga, yeah. Yep. <laughs> that that was all introducing the um <laughs> the autosave feature, by the way. <laughs> that plays every time it autosaves. It autosaves every couple <laughs> seconds, so get used to it. Sweet. <laughs> um, awesome. Well... All right, let's just like pretend nothing happened. <laughs> uh, so the only thing I think I want to point out before we start is these guys are Kodama, and I really like them a lot, and they're really awesome. Which one do you play as? I hope it's Red Hat. I, I think it's Co-op. All right, that's enough. Let's get the crow off our sword and get going here. Ah! No. Oh no! Wait, what? Let me get my atlas. This. Oh wow, Sipangu is a really, really old name for Japan. I think that's no the shit. original uh, Portuguese name that gave to it. Mm-hmm. Look, there yep. you go, Marco Polo. I'm learning something already. Is there so, required reading for this let's play? Get out Wikipedia so we sound smart. Okay. Japan is to the west of the United States. I'm and the little quote comes up and says diabetes 2017. Stone. Under that. <laughs> the Philosopher's Stone. Is this some Harry Potter shit? I think so. Oh. oh. The Queen of England oh. is locked in combat. The Queen is in combat? Inside the Philosopher's Stone. Help her out. With Spain. She can legally murder anyone she wants so long as she does it with a sword. For control of the entire world. I don't think that's true. 
No, yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> Are you gonna tell the queen what she can't do? We're pirates. That's pretty sweet. Cool. Mm-hmm. Pirate samurai? <laughs> now I've seen everything. <laughs> well, the game hasn't even started, and I like it. The end. We'll just stop on a high note. <laughs> and it's on sale now. And it's the Home Shopping Network. <laughs> For two easy payment payments of thirteen ninety nine. The uh, Tower of London. I knew that. Um, like still right now. <laughs> so, there we go. Continue. Jeez, a lot of fucking cutscene. Right. When do we cut shit with? Blades. I want to get to Japan. Or uh, Zapingu? Was that it? Zapangu. Uh, Zapadaba ding Zipangu. dong, I think. Zipang. Zip, zip, zippity doo. Zabadaba doo. Yabba, yabba dabba doo. This is Undead Asylum. What a goddamn ripoff. <laughs> All I need to do is throw a corpse down. Here, I'm just going to go ahead and give you an Estus flask. <laughs> We're totally ripping this off. Let's make this clear. <laughs> Good morning to you too, honey. <laughs> okay. All right. Hmm. Whoa, what? All right. So. Hey, listen. <laughs> this isn't Japan. Yeah. What the hell? I've, I've been, been lied, lied to. to. Hmm. We've both been lied to. All right, so be this. I'm going to teach you a little bit about this game, okay? Okay. What do you, you got? You see the, t the two meters in the upper left? I do. You know how you'd think that that's health and stamina? Yeah. You're wrong. It's health and key. Uh, oh. Legally like distinct. One taste has a, has a distinct uh, artificial sweetener flavor to mm -hmm. it. And this key seems to refill and deplete as you exert yourself. Right. I know how like to endurance, perhaps. What? Well, damn, man, Billy, you're strong as heck. Wow. I just like this cell better. Uh, I, I'm assuming if the game's telling me to sprint, I should just run for it. That's a fair assumption. Maybe. That's probably like that first werewolf you find in Bloodborne, though. Try and beat him up. All right. Let's see. Let's. Maybe I can take him. If I watch his stamina, maybe I could like draw him out to get tired, or. Uh -oh. Or you could kick him in the dick. Oh dear. No, I'm not a samurai, granted. Yeah. That's true. No, that's true. Well, neither am I. I'm, I'm like some guy in my underwear in the Tower of London. Yeah, what the hell is Japan? It's bullshit. There we go. Oh wow, my god, you punched him so I... hard he exploded a little bit. I would be embarrassed. I'll just, if I were him. And you got his sword, you so... bastard. <laughs> Such language, oh Neo. Jeez. I thought this was a family game. Right? Fuck no. He, I can't take his clothes or anything? What's or next? Anything? The shit shield? <laughs> I would not so use that shield. So, it looks like we have... No. Uh, for those of you who play the demo, the key pulse stuff doesn't seem to have come into the equation yet. Uh, spoilers. Sorry for... Alright, we'll get... We'll dungeon get... key used! <laughs> Puzzle solved. Good job. Thank you. Maybe either maybe you don't even have to go to Japan in this. One ticket to Zapingu, please. What is this? Guard boots. Another bastard. Can sword. you dual wield? Uh you can, but like not like you're thinking. 
Like, there is a double sword kind of weapon, but it, it goes in one slot, you know? Can you put it in your ranged weapon slot and throw infinite bastard swords? <laughs> yes. Um, equipment, equipment in this game, if it's like the demo, works a bit like Diablo. You can see, like, thing, like all the different weapons have, like, little stat, random kind of stat things. Like, this mm -hmm. one, they look mostly the same, but the one I have equipped has a 5.2% quick attack key reduction so it's like stamina reduction heart attack and this one had heart huh? attack uh key attack quick attack change to attack parentheses heart i'm looking at oh heart i see it yeah oh so that increases right. the likelihood that you'll have a heart attack as you use it <laughs> that yeah let's go to critical i'll use the critical one i think i think heart is like one of the stats you can upgrade you know so, so like you take a it's take like a stat or something. I like something to think like he's that. leveling up his empathy. You know, he's becoming a better person by leveling up your heart. <laughs> and his heart lets you swing a sword better. Oh. He cares more about London. Nice. Let's see here. Ooh. Uh oh! Item shortcut medicine. Are they trying to give you the Konami code? All right. <laughs> so you know this deal, right? Like, or you know how like a Souls game, they like put like items on the cross there, you know, and yep, like, yep, yep. right. So Neo lets you customize that. Yeah, and gives you like two levels of it. it. Looks like there's some big thing in my way of this door, which I don't get. But well, that okay. ain't gonna work. No sir. Let's see here. Um. This this is kind of sort of not really but kind of based on like a real person named William Adams. Uh, I read a little bit about him on Wikipedia, therefore I'm an expert. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I don't remember him getting arrested in the Tower of London, but oh dear. Did a magical sprite person so, also encourage him to break out of jail? Not uh, yes, but that happened way long ago. No, that was for an entirely different reason. Oh, gotcha. Okay. He was just arrested for shoplifting. <laughs> it's harsh. <laughs> Fuck. Ownership of things back in the 1400s or whatever. It was a really big deal. Well, things aren't as... So is medicine your typical flask slash herb whatever? Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Um, I think it was called something else in the demo, but... Yeah, it's your typical, like, flask kind of deal. Like, you go to your... This game's analog of a bonfire. Like, you get a minimum amount that it restores to, but you can also pick up extras along the way. Does that make sense? It does. Yeah. 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 So typically, yeah, you have, like, a base minimum. Ooh, dear. And what are the fire uh, things that fly into you as you open chests? <laughs> I'm sorry, say again? The uh, fire things that fly into you as you open chests. Oh, um, so that's Amrita, which they mentioned in the intro. And as far as I knew from the demo, is pretty much the new Souls. Um, uh, okay. or Echoes. Like, the, cur there's cur there's currency like an RPG, but Amrita is kind of like experience. And if you die, it, you drop somewhere, and you have one chance to get it back. Ooh, what the? It all sounds familiar. Speak of the devil, I think. Yep, here's a shrine I can pray at. I distinctly noticed you picked up a pair of pants and did not put them on. Did I, is that a filthy, filthy boy? I, I change, picked up a pair of pants. leg guards. Come on. Get some fashion neo in here. Hmm. That is, yeah, okay. That looks, oh, that's good. You know, um, yeah. That's actually what it's I'm wearing good right choice. now. Good choice. Pretty manly. Yeah. I like it. It's my typical nighttime wear. Huh? I'm turning on my webcam. Casual. Damn it. You can take two on at once, come on. I think I can, these guys are pretty pushovery. That's what, that's what you get for, oh dear. Shouldn't have done a heavy attack there, okay, but still. These aren't samurai slowly, they're Englishmen. <laughs> yeah. They just probably got back from their tea time in cricket. <laughs> Seriously, not like I was too full of biscuits to fight well. Oh, <laughs> not like my glorious samurai that I hope to encounter. 
Oh, I'm going to become one someday. Someday. Pip, pip. <laughs> if I know what Japan is, which I'm not sure I do historically yet. I think it's called the Zipingu. <laughs> the ancient lands. I think I've read the ancient texts in my loading screens at home. Uh, did I not equip that? I thought oh, I did equip that. Um, which which is better, axe or stronger, axe or bastard? Uh, how do I switch? I think there's like a way I can quick switch weapons. Try the Souls way. Uh, circle doesn't seem to do anything. Squares light attack. What about the D-pad? No, D-pad's like the items on the lower left, you know? Uh, what about... Check those shoulder buttons. L1 guards. L2 makes my range weapon ding. R2 makes my... Yeah, I don't think that's it. Oh, wait, here we go. You have to hold R1. Got it. There's my axe. Let's see how that goes. Predictably slower, but kind of, you know, heftier, I'd imagine. Let's give the axe a whirl. Look, leaves some glitter trails behind it as well. It looks like it swings around you, too, which could be useful. Mm. It's called crowd, crowd control. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yep. yep. That's what they call it in nice glorious sub Pingu? London. <laughs> so what does prayer do? I'm guessing Runka. I'm guessing prayer is and let's not turn it into a big religious debate, okay? <laughs> in the context of the game. <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess I'm guessing Runka is like a spear, it looks like. So let's see. I'll change off. Yeah, you're getting a lot of weapons off the bat. I think they're giving me like the different types kind of to like get me used to them, you know? Like there's different classes with of weapon with weapons like these, who needs clothes? Not me. Alright, should I try spear or axe? What do you think? I I am not never been a fan of spears in games like this. That's true. I might as well give it a shot though. I, Cause I I wait, this door must be open from the other side. Alright then. Classic Dark Soulsism. Let me ask this: uh, If you're in the Tower yeah. of London, do you want to like climb it? I mean, or, it's a tower. Like so. descend it to get out to ground level. If there's one thing I've learned from TV shows about escaping from prison, sometimes you gotta go up to go down and out. Plus, video games—they always want you to like climb shit, right? Yeah, I mean, it's a tower. So what you're saying is, to leave the tower, we gotta get up, get up, get up to get down? That is exactly what I'm saying. Wait. Sounds good to me. Oh. We, they, they're calling it Japan. Can we call it Japan now? Or Nihon? No. Nippon. Sure. Once tomorrow's execution takes place, we will get our hands on a compass that will lead us Alright, so they're plotting, they're basically saying... They've got all the Amrita they need, fuck the pirates, then we can kill the leader of Japan, and then we can subdue Spain and perhaps even the world. Well, they don't sound London-y enough. Oh, and the Queen, yeah, she doesn't even get what Amrita's for. Edward Kelly, you will go to Japan. <laughs> I hope that's not the name of the main bad guy. <laughs> Edward Kelly is also a real person. Just stand here. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, hey! Oh, man. Is the dude's in the door hear that? Yep. I, I don't know. I don't have time to worry about it. I hope you know how to use the spear. Um, spear's okay. Oh, I've also got stone. Yeah, stones. So I think that works kind of like pebbles, you know, where you can like throw them. Mm. A simple rock. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was killing a guy. What were you saying in there, to Edward Kelly? Hmm. Ooh, I got gloves. Yeah, put them on. We almost got a good outfit. I really oh. 
I really hope that we get the the hat next, and we just never find the, the shirt. <laughs> this, you get the shirt after beating the last boss. I yeah. don't know that I like these gloves so much. They're well, they're practical, right? They're white, but they're also enormous on me. Like, look how big my hands look now. <laughs> yeah, well, it's you know what they say about big hands. <laughs> I do know what they say about that. Uh, big spears, right? Yep, yep. <laughs> All right, let's just switch to our manly axe. Our manly. And now you won't leave as much DNA evidence in the Tower of London that they can run through the database. Right, right. Now I can, uh, our big manly Irish axe. Let's do this. Whoop, hmm? <laughs> I heard a hmm. Hmm? What was that axe? And I keep pressing R1 for some reason or another. <laughs> That's weird. Uh. Hmm. All right. I wonder if there are controller setup options. <laughs> there must be. There must. There must be one that's like, yeah, it's like that other game. Just do it already. <laughs> All right, let's. We're legally distinct. We put strong and light attack on square and triangle. <laughs> oh my god! They just loaded the first Dark Souls tutorial area. <gasps> um, wow. So, even though I feel like I ran across, you know, if that makes sense, like, this is that was a different stairway. Are and you lost enemies... in the first area of the game? No, it just this looks a little symmetrical. Like, this room, you know, looks like we've been here, but. Oh dear. Gotta remember, I so guess. So, if you rest at the. Uh... If you rest at the analog to the bonfire, will the analog to evil demons also return? So, I'm going to say the answer is yes. It's just that we, we're we not, like, in a place of... You know what I mean? Where that would make sense. Right. That's why I'm kind of like, well... Like, it's telling me to guard and dodge again, which almost makes me feel like I just headed backwards. Maybe it's just reminding you because you don't do those things. No, I do those things. Uh, I'm pretty sure we've been on this goddamn bridge. <sighs> Boo! Oh, wait, look. I am. No, apparently you haven't been this way. Or I just missed this the first time. Oh, we just we missed that chest. Yeah, we've been here. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. What's this? Well, wasn't it worth going back? Oh, I got a coat. Uh, I think Damn you it. should stay shirtless. I we think. should at least check out the coat and see if we like I it guess or not. You should. If we have to, we can take off our pants instead. <laughs> as long as some part of you is, <laughs> as long as some part of you is always exposed. That sounds right. That's all I'm asking. Let's say. Head armor. Head armor. Yeah. What? <laughs> Something to say? Uh, oh, there uh, we are. Yeah, all right. <laughs> you know what? It accessorizes with your gloves now. It's a good idea. <laughs> it I can does. test myself, Mom. <laughs> what if now the guards are like, oh, you're one of us? Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> so what I was saying before is these aren't like the Japanese shrines that you encounter in the demo that I would think would reset all like the monsters and bad guys. Like, but I guess, yeah, even here, it's just like, well, whatever. We're going to reset everything. These are non-pagan, right and proper Anglo-Saxon church shrines. Thank you very much. Mm. And you know what? To okay. be fair, if they're using that Amrita stuff, then you know. Um, Damn. One thing I should mention too is back attacks hurt really, really, really bad in this game. Believe me, I like, saw those numbers going around 420. Never, like, they don't have the tried and true backstab of the Souls game, but, like, it's pretty much, like, it used to be double damage. I think they nerfed it a bit, but it's kind of a death sentence. But there's there's not, like, a specific backstab move like the Bloodborne Souls games? Right, right. It's just, like, your, your back takes just much more damage. Yeah. Bigger <laughs> numbers. Mm-hmm. Boots, but they're crappy. Hmm? Are they the same as the boots you currently are wearing? Yeah, I think so. 
Well, hang on. Well, put them on over your current boots. Of course you can. Double the protection. William Adams. I wear five pairs of shoes, Slowbeef. Excuse me, but William Adams has at the same time feet. Yeah. Two of you. Couple couple of jokesters here. Right. Bastard swords. So yeah, it is, it is worth checking out like the different weapons you pick up too, as they might have like all little stat things. I think. Um, here's a new area. Nice. Mm -hmm. Ah. Oh. Guard and dodge. Can I don't want to be in London. Wanna... London's boring and gray. But London's calling. Rainy. I'm gonna, they got I'm gonna let it rain. Right. <laughs> Alright. So far I'm liking the axe the best. Maybe I'll try the spear a little more. If though. these were authentic London guards, wouldn't they just be standing there doing nothing? <laughs> Wearing fuzzy hats? <gasps> oh. Where's my immersion? Uh oh. Knights. Ah. Oh dear. This is gonna be a problem. Ooh. Oh, Take I wonder off if your clothes and see if they do the same. <laughs> this is probably the don't go here point of the I was thinking the, maybe it was tutorial. the you are meant to die at this kind of deal, you know? And then, like, we'll wake up no. at, like, the thing, and then the game will be like, what? Why am I alive? This is not a boss fight. This is not a boss fight, Slowly, if you're not confined to an arena with the odds against you. Oh. <laughs> wow, that's... I prefer the Rest simplicity if you died, personally, but... Yeah, you would. But it was all a dream. Alright. Now let's pray for that not to happen this time. Let's... Alright, enough's enough here, because I know... I know we want to... Let's put on my other pair of boots. <laughs> let's put on pants before we fight the knights. How does that sound? Nice. Alright. Do you have to fight the knights? I mean... I don't know, I guess... They seemed a little out of your league. All right, then. In that case, let's I go. I don't think up they're the gonna date you. Is what I'm saying. Again. I mean, they might be out of your league, but I bet there's something behind them because of that kind of game. Mm -hmm. Can you do roll dodging with iframes? You cannot. Uh, there is not roll dodging per se. I'm closing out of this stream. <laughs> but there's a quick dash that basically does the same yeah. thing. Yeah. Okay, I'm back in. Yeah. You can also parry by blocking at the right time, I believe. Although, I'm not sure if it's... I'm... Put on the hat. Put on the hat. Hold on, let me... And not even these guys are wearing their hat. Right? Do I have a hat? What's the uniform code? God. Is it a top hat, I hope? <laughs> yeah, you just got a hat. I really want to see you win that outfit with <laughs> the top hat on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. Nice. Nice. Yes. Now I blend in. <laughs> if my travels ever right by this, <laughs> you pass by the two knights that just nod and acknowledge you. <laughs> if I welcome back. If I ever, if my travels ever take me to the land of the rising sun, I will keep this hat as a souvenir. But I don't think that'll happen. Whoa. The great samurai Heisenberg. <laughs> Say my name. I am the one who chops. <laughs> Breaking Warui. That's all I know. Watashi wa waruta. Slowly, can you please take off your pants as you do this roleplay? <laughs> that's the that's the level of humor you could expect. Just random Japanese words for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Dick Tron goes, I gotta go. <laughs> That's how you run a successful YouTube channel for so long. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like I've explored this place, and I think we're gonna have to go outside. Maybe not toward the knights, but, you know. Do everything except aggroing the knights, see what that gets you. Yeah. Um... Yeah. Huh? 
I, these guys are it's so weird it's like they've never seen anyone try to escape prison they've never seen anyone punch through their cell wall and take take up arms and kill hunt like tens of their guys i mean that does seem kind of unprecedented i mean also he got killed once and then got back up it was real weird <laughs> what the heck no that's a different the guy. only other time that's that's a different guy this guy's got a hat the only other time someone punched through our walls when we were in prison to Sir Redfield. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna bring the bastard. I have a better bastard sword, and use that. Well, I'm gonna keep with the axe for now. But I don't know how I feel about the Runka just yet. I just want you. You don't know if you're gonna Runka with it. Nah, not yet. I might Runka with it later, but. Yay. Um, Stay out of my territory. Which is Japan. <laughs> Zapinga. Yeah. Zappos. I forgot. Damn it. Huh? Zappos? The place where you buy shoes? Yeah. Oh, okay. Where you buy kutsu, I believe, is what you meant to say. Mm -hmm. I buy all my guard boots there. <laughs> Oh, I'm afraid you'll need a knight's key to get through this gate. Um, oh wait, no, it just leads out to fucking sea. I don't want to go there. Swim to freedom. Swim to Japan. Yeah, it's not too far, right? Can't take that long. Yeah. yeah. I've got a world is small. Looks like I might be able to escape from the top of that tower. Oh, why does it look like you can escape from the top of there? What indicates that? That's a how do you escape from a tower from the top of it? Maybe he means... No, I don't know. That doesn't... That. Oh, there's a helicopter up there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. One night. All right, maybe I can take one night? You can handle one. Yeah. Oh, okay, but... All right, he's got a friend well... who's not a knight, though. <laughs> I'm a mini knight, huh? <laughs> A knight and a scrub. I forgot my armor, Tony. Let's just go for it, then. <laughs> Where's my accent, Tony? You forgot that, too. What I get? Okay, you get the your medicine. accent once you get knighted by Her Majesty. <laughs> oh, look who's low on stamina because of all that armor. Oh, he's not, though. Um, I would have thought. You did, uh, you did embarrass him by knocking him off that ledge. He's got two hit combos, it looks like. Your axe is nice and red. Yeah. Or is that just lighting? No, it's I painted it that color. It's nice. No, it is. It's, it's oh. bloody. Yeah. Oh, I got kisses? Queeses? Queeses. What are queeses? They are leg armor. Oh. They're for the legs. They're for the upper thighs. Hmm. I, oh, I have a slightly better hat. <laughs> um, and queases are way better, and I'm so that's a that's a thing. Is there RNG with stats of armors and swords and stuff? It's a little Diablo like, yeah. Um, the alpha demo had a thing where all, all weapons and armor had like shit durability, and you like kind of had to switch off, and it was really like I kind of liked it, but it was very annoying because you just have to keep going to the menu. So for the beta demo, there's three demos total. Like they, um, they tone that down a lot. Okay. So it's now it's just like you get a lot of items with those stat things. Ooh, breastplate. Don't mind if I do. I don't think. Yeah. And I'm at 64. Fashion be damned. I don't know if you see right above me. Uh, there's uh, equipment weight is a thing too. It's still green. So. What is the threshold for being slow? I'm at 64.7%, so I think I'm still good. I'm going to guess maybe like 70, 80, somewhere in there. I don't know. All right, another knight. Damn, oh, that was a pretty boy. powerful stone. Yeah, no, it's a, it's a rock, really. It's not like, a, you know. Uh, Did 44 damage to a guy in full knight armor. Though. Yeah, but Throw a rock hard enough at anyone, it'll hurt him. You know how much that stone weighs? How much? 44 One pounds. One stone. 
Hold on, gents. I've got a better way of measuring weight. Also, I guess I'm Australian. Sorry. <laughs> From the prison colony there, eh? Yeah. You goijin aren't gonna get any Omrita. Crikey, you see when he opens his chest and the little shrimps on the barbie fly into him? You see this hatted drongo over here? Did you hear about me mate Joseph's crazy adventure? Quite bizarre. I'll name it something in the future. Never mind, okay. I don't have time to joke at fighting mates! Um... You heard of this is a penga place up north? East? Well, actually, it's way back when. We're not good with maps and directions or anything. I believe if you go straight, you'll go to it. Little does this idiot know it'd be a lot easier to kill us with the spear. Wait, am I William <laughs> or these guys now? <laughs> there we go. One down. Ooh, great helm. <laughs> I knew a uh, I knew a knight who gave great helm. If you know what I mean. Oh my God, I don't. Me neither, actually. It's what they called it when it when it lasts. I can't stand it. I'm in the middle of soul fighting. Each you, you talking about Paul Singer bastard sword? <laughs> ah, just die, please. Oh God. Oh God. Come on now, you got this. You're so close. I know, but he keeps oh god, he's guarding and Oh, he just did he just parry you sort of? I don't know what he did. This, this knight has got you there down, buddy. Greaves too. Oh my god, he was smuggling medicine. <laughs> Alright. Great helm brings me to 75.9. Uh, but that does, that makes me yellow, and I think I want to stay fast. Well, I mean, yeah, me... and the other hat looks much better. Yeah, honestly. So, let's just, I just want to see, like, what it, how it slows down your movement. I don't seem that slow. My back dash seems, like, shorter, if that makes sense, you know? Mm-hmm. Oh, and it looks like my stamina, uh, <clears throat> my key is dropping a lot faster, too. You can call it endurance, it's uh, I think, I'm thinking let's go back to the hat. Duh. Yeah. Uh, let me see how the, the greaves do. Well, the greaves make me yellow also, so maybe we'll just keep the boots on. So there's no character customization or anything here? No, there's not. You're, you're William Adams, no matter what you do. The old Bilster. And does he look like this, historically? Yes. Course. Did you ever see the movie The Last Samurai? Uh, yes. In fact, I watched it to do research for this game. Did you really? Good call. No. I read it on Wikipedia. I did think about watching it. <laughs> I, read a, I, read, I read about it on Wikipedia, and it had pretty much nothing at all to do with this guy's life. Like, it was so many... It's like, there was a white guy in Japan. That's all we're... We'll, we'll just make up the story from there. Mm -hmm. um, That's all you really It wasn't know. even actually... The last non-white samurai, la, la non-Japanese samurai either. There were ones after him. Was Mark Wahlberg there as well? Of course. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mark Wahlberg, no, no samurai. Yeah. I mean, if Tom Cruise could pass for a samurai, Mark Wahlberg could, could too. <laughs> well, if Geralt of Rivera or whatever his name is can pass for a samurai. That's my guy, right? Mm -hmm. Geralt of Kansai, yeah. Um, this looks like. I was where I came from, and going left here is where I encountered the, the, these two assholes who killed me before. Well, you killed two knights before. Can you do it again? You're out of medicine, though. No, I'm not. I have ten. Ah, I always got ten. Oh, that's ten. Okay. Yeah. I thought the medicine was leaking. Fortunately, the AI is, like, okay in this game, so I couldn't trick out here. Oh, oh, boy. All right, I'm in trouble. Um... Can you do the Solzy maneuver where you take them so far that they de-aggro and slowly go back to their starting point? You can maybe pick off one of them? Uh... That's fine. Well, actually, I got one... F or maybe there's a shrine right here. It's right to your right. I think they're too close to me for me to pray. You can try, though. Nope. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Oh takes a second to pray, unfortunately. 
Alright. So if I can kill these guys. Oh, who's low on stamina? It's you! Oh, but it's not the other guy. That's the worst so battle you, cry I've ever heard. Do you see that? Um, <laughs> did you see how he like collapsed though? So like, yeah, running out of stamina has a really bad effect yeah, where you get winded if you try to attack when you're out of it, and you're completely open. And then if you get hit while you're winded, you get collapse. You collapse, and they can do like a hit you on the ground thing. So like, stamina, stamina is important like in a Souls game, but it's like there's a giant penalty if you fuck it up. HP is pretty important as well. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> mm -hmm. God, get him. Okay. Remember not to get the I didn't. I didn't, but I had to like get get rid of him with one. Yeah, his, his HP is pretty low. This other axe guy. Shit. Listen. How's this sound? You're gonna die. I'm talking to him. Why don't oh. we just call it? You can walk away. I mean, no big deal. I got nine, eight more medicine. All right. Well, he didn't go for it. Yay. And now he's dead. Now he's dead. I, I gave him, I granted him clemency. Every, I, I had a Kaikaku for him. Uh, mm -hmm. there we go. Now, please pray. The knights that you just killed. Hmm. I pledge allegiance. Okay, I'm done. I didn't remember prayer being so sparky. Um, Such a half-assed prayer, just spending like a second there. Dear Lord, uh, <laughs> our Father. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh wait. So off to the. Spiky chair with me once now that they have monsters to fight. Audio okay, by the way? Ooh. Mm -hmm. right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty <laughs> awkward tutorial <laughs> message. <laughs> Waiting for our stamina to run down so we can't counterattack. <laughs> really, this is what I have to use my soul remnants for, is to roundabout way tell a guy how to do a strong attack. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I, <laughs> I hope whoever finds my body doesn't remember that it armor runs out of durability every so often. It should be repaired. They exhausted me, and when they did so, I collapsed. <laughs> and when I collapsed, a strong attack was done unto me. I wonder if in the future they'll invent a thing called a circle button, and if so, that that would let me dodge. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'll never know. Oh. And then one guy's like, look, just pray and this will save your game. <laughs> I got no lorry way to say that. The time in London is convoluted. This. Oh dear. Oh, look who got behind you, it's me. William Adams. <laughs> By the way, I heard final blow. Good old Billy. Oh, wait. Oh, stamina. Okay. Don't collapse on me. I managed to, like, avoid, you know... Oh dear. <laughs> Thanks. Take your medicine. I'm trying, but uh, I didn't do it in time. You got me before the animation. Well, bye. <laughs> but hey, at least you're freed. One thing I do have to say that this game has pretty well is there's been no loading. Yeah, that's true. It actually did that better than Bloodborne. Yeah. Um, <laughs> most games did it better than Bloodborne on launch, though. <laughs> no. <laughs> Huh? Man. So, do you still prefer the axe over the sword? I think. Um, let me go back to the sword maybe a little bit. I'm like... I think you actually picked up a couple of blue swords, so even better. I thought they were all bastard swords, but I'll give it a shot. Hold that one. Well, 
I mean blue bastard swords. Oh, dear. The name was blue. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Don't try to whack him off when he's defending. He's almost dead. And he's almost out of stamina. Another thing, too, is he needs, you know, you can see there, stamina. Hey. Uh, now he's out of both. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know you can see their stamina. Did you notice that? Yep. Mm -hmm. I just wanted Sandy. to point that out. Uh, yes. Yeah, That's a strong battle axe. Yes, it is. 80. Whoa. Hello. You have a 96 battle axe. Yeah, actually, let's. Well, that's the one you're already using, I think. Right. Oh, yeah. I have the 96 one I'm using, yeah. Um, let me see. Do I have a better s sword I have is a, seven, a 50. Yeah, I think that's the best sword I have. You can... You got a 57 one right there. Mm -hmm. It's the second one. Third from the top. Oh, I see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah. right. That also... It's got a familiarity damage bonus, too. Uh, ah, so the more you use it, the better it gets. I thought that meant the more you know someone, the more it hurts them. It's... Yeah. <laughs> All right. That only takes place if you keep on leveling up your heart. Ooh, so you know what? I'm liking sword again, though. It's quick. Should I get up? He wants to go up this tower, right? Or something? I didn't... Just up in general. I didn't follow his plan, still. Uh, He saw something on the roof that could help him escape. A hang ladder, maybe. Oh, that'd be awesome. Hang ladder section. Hell yeah. Wait, I heard something. This looks like an arena of sorts to fight someone. Yeah, like Derek the Executioner. Derek, though, seems like he... That... Where did Derek come from? I think he was kind of... I think he hopped yeah, down? maybe. I heard, like... Oh, I think he came from that other gate there. I, I heard gatey kind of sounds. Oh, shit. I whiffed that. Oh, boy. Just approach him like the Executioner in Resident Evil 5. Got it. I'm trying to get him to run low on stamina, if possible, maybe? Or just maybe I'll... Well, he can't swing infinitely. Just wait for him to do a combo and then give him a little poke. Ooh, that was a pretty good hit. For a yeah. boss meter, Derek though. Derek in the back, you jerk. Oh, he's the tutorial boss. He can't be that hard. Not only that, but he, he seems no. like just kind of like a toughy enemy. You know what I mean? Like, he's already dead. Yeah. Maybe Derek has a face, too. <laughs> Super Derek. Uh, Whoa. It's oh, you. <laughs> with the guardians. <laughs> <laughs> and the silly hat. Oh. oh. If I die, the secret of the stones dies with yeah. me. Yeah. Let me show you what these stones can do. <laughs> he grabs his balls. <laughs> <laughs> no, he was already dead. It's time for your execution. Uh oh. Oh, Derek does have a phase two. Oh. Wow, oh. I didn't think you really did. My name's Derek. <laughs> Demon Derek. No, it's still Derek. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> oh, it's still Derek. Okay. Focus your strength. De Derek the Executioner. Er. Executionerist. Yeah, that... Two executions for the price of one. What is growing out of Derek? He's smoking. Which you shouldn't do at home, All by right, the way. Jim Carrey. <laughs> Red stuff. Yikes! So it looks like he's kind of the same, but. Whoa! Okay! Wow. Uh. There's less Derek than there was before, I've noticed. It looks like when he got all juiced up, somehow his axe got bigger, too. <laughs> yeah. Neat. He's got. Juiced axe. And it, it looks like he's got very little in the way of stamina. Oh, you know what? He's got... Maybe he... Oh, he has uh, the demon key, doesn't yep. he? This is in the demo, but it's said to use living weapon with... 
uh, square and circle together, which is another thing. Yeah, cannot connect to network. <laughs> wow, what a powerful attack. It knocked out the internet in the London Tower. <laughs> I can't get on the Wi-Fi. Impressive. <laughs> I have 4G that connection! Oh. Now don't quote me on this, but I'm at least reasonably sure that Edward Kelly was not a vampire sorcerer of some kind. <laughs> I'm starting to question the historical nature of this video. Uh, what was the thing I saw up here that could help me escape? I don't remember! Uh, why did I think this was a good idea? Oh, I got shot. <laughs> well, t time to go drift on de Death's door to Japan. If only I'd not worn all this armor and cuisses and such. Wait, this will help me grow a cape that I can use to fly. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't speak Japanese. <laughs> oh, death is an entry to life. That's how that's been happening. I suppose. Oh. And then you respawn back everything. before you fought Derek. <laughs> like, that's not what, how it's supposed to... Oh, that was a cutscene death. <laughs> Spoiler, you're, now you're playing as Derek. A, cool. a trophy, too. Congratulations. This is one of those games where there's a trophy for incremental progress. Oh, uh, what? Oh, what? Gameplay recording. Po okay. That's uh, that's the PlayStation. I can't share this section of the game. <laughs> was not an enjoyable... Wait, how did we get from escaping a prison to this ship? I mean, we swam. Well, I'd share it with you, but Kalof I can't. Was lost. The trow sank. Why the hope <laughs> vanished without a trace. The good news the who? of the boats oh. hub was nothing but lies. Only Lufta remained. I had a metaphor for that one, but an ironic twist. What awaited us in the Far East wasn't love. Oh, come on! That could have worked for any of the ships. <laughs> and save points, I guess. He could have found his faith in Japan. You don't know that. <laughs> Alright, well, that was a pretty good game, all in all. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Uh, final boss was a little simple, but 